and I was intrigued when I saw it. I was like, man, the first thing that came to my mind was Uganda sits on the equator, so there's no better place for the Obis. Exactly. Yeah, so I, uh, I, got, I started really getting involved in it, and because of my excitement of the technology, I was appointed on the Rotary Board. So I sit on the Rotary Board, Solar Oven Program Committee Board, uh, which uh, approves projects to be funded, and I'm in charge of the Africa. So through Rotary, I have worked with this technology, Sun Oven sent them all over Africa. So they are, they are people are already using them? People are already using them. How effective are they? Very effective. They are how, very effective. How, how does it work? They are, they, they are, the, 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 they are simple, simple device, simple technology, which cooks by setting it up like this and focusing it into the sun. But what? Uh, I will demonstrate how it is. This is how it looks when you get it out of the box. And it's made up of wood. This is a wood and it's made of plastic. And there are two shells and okay, made of plastic and a, and a glass. But there are two shells in here. There is an inner shell and the outer shell. Okay. And right between the outer and the in uh, the outer and the inner there is insulation okay. which keeps which prevents conduction of heat right. away outside outward and also this metal plate now this metal plate helps to uh, when, during the process of adjusting and refocusing the oven in the sun that it, it prevents the food from spilling and I will show you when you open it and you have to track the sun on its axis then that's that 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 uh, Swings back and forth. And this is the standard size. This is the family size. There are two sizes: this one and the big one, which is industrial size, uh, which is also operational in Uganda. We have over ten, about ten of them in Uganda, big ones. But my concentration is on the small ones. Now, here uh, in U in the US, they are sold for about two hundred and seventy dollars. And all the pilot programs we've done, we've had to pay that price and add transportation and up, uh, to take them all the way to Uganda. Right, right. The first initial problem also we had was the government was taxing them because of just this simple oven. Yeah, so it was classified as an appliance. Mm -hmm. So we worked with the government and they granted us exemption. So uh, the, we are now tax exempt. So to import them now. Because of the transportation and the cost of the oven, mm -hmm. what makes it to cost more here in the US because of the labor cost and uh, I figured okay I can really uh, save on, uh, on the transportation and also uh, the labor because we have cheap labor in, in Uganda and also job creation because it's labor intensive the, man, the manufacturing process is labor intensive but it is not reliant on the power supply so you can manufacture this oven without plugging into electricity using different tools and uh, the longer the, the, the number of the tools the more number of people you can employ so that was also uh, also a very good advantage but also when we manufacture them in Uganda we're going to be selling them cheaper and uh, because we can afford to we, our, our labor costs are so, are so low and also uh, we can have the training facilities and people to, to, uh, to start to train the people to use them other, other than just keeping on sending them there but we still would make money because we make a profit uh, the question is yes. how does the technology itself work the technology itself works as the regular oven it cooks convectionally and that's where the training comes in we have to train the people to understand how to cook convectionally from the traditional way of cooking uh, or above the flame. Right, right. Yeah. No, but the thing is, uh, I, I want to know, so this, this attracts the, no, the, no. the, the sun? No. You focus the sun, the oven in the sun, mm -hmm. and if you focused it and looked at it when it is focused, you will see something like that. Okay. Yeah. Now, all so that energy, control. yes, all that energy okay. is going to be trapped into the chamber. Okay. And the chamber is going to be boiled up. 
it's called, it's, it, does it convert it to electricity? No, sir. Okay. Direct heat. It just converts Dir it to heat? Yeah, direct heat. Okay, so yes. sunlight to heat. Sunlight to heat. Does, does it matter how intense the sun is? No, it doesn't matter. It just matter. has to be sunlight. It has to be sunlight. It's, it has to be the sun. And if you can see your shadow, it is cooking. As mm. simple as that. So that there's a conversion process there. It's, it's direct uh, sun, UV rays, and sun uh, rays consolidated in the chamber uh -huh. to, uh, to into heat uh, what, and that's what it. What is the heat capacity? How does it, it can on? boil in, uh, we've, I've seen it coming all the way up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit and uh, uh, you know up to like actually when you set it up 15 minutes after setting it up it's already above 100 in our sun. Yeah. Oh. yeah. Uh, and I'm thinking if in rainy days uh, when this coverage yeah, yeah. The, when when you don't have the sun, yeah, that's why uh, 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 I printed it out there, but it doesn't. It, it was misprinted. But here, I uh, as a, a small writer, I said it, it saves seventy percent of your cooking meat. Seventy percent will leave an allowance of the thirty for the night, yeah. and also the cloudy or rainy days when it doesn't uh, so shine. So it saves the heat. No, 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 it doesn't save. It doesn't, it does not save the heat. It does not... So it only works it, when it's... Yeah, uh -huh. yeah, it works when... Yeah, right. so you cannot store the, the heat. But if you've been cooking, uh, say at sundown, you, you put your dinner in at 4 o'clock. By 6, it's ready. If you don't open up the glass there, the food is going to stay hot at a serving temperature four hours after either you take it inside or after you close it. So it, it, it helps us even to, to meet our cultural sensitivity of eating way, eating way after sundown. Right.